JJ Jinx. Truck stop. JJ Jinx here with my buddy Avijit. Today we are going to taste test a whole bunch of um, different products that we picked up at the HERS factory. HERS. You can get all kinds of flavors and varieties that you don't normally find in the stores. Um, so this is going to be an adventure. Ready? Yes. Cotton candy blue balls. <laughs> They're crunchy and sweet. Crunchy and sweet flavored snack balls. Gluten free. Yeah, they're like little smurf turds. <laughs> All right. All right. Cheers. There it goes. Cheers. Surprisingly, not bad at all. Hmm. I don't. I don't. I don't dislike that. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I was going to hate it. <laughs> what other one? Yes, please. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, I can't eat like a million of them, mm. but that's actually a good flavor. Pleasantly surprised. Um. It doesn't taste like cotton candy to me, though. No. Cotton candy is so much. Uh, Texture and consistency, though. Maybe it does taste like cotton candy, and I don't know. We have a lot. <laughs> okay, so launching off of the snack ball theme, we have another one. This one is funnel cake. This one is funnel cake flavored. So things that you can get at like a fair, you know, cotton mm -hmm. candy, funnel cake, meth. <laughs> oh, that's got a really weird smell. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Mm. I like that one less. Yeah, <laughs> the blue balls are better. Blue balls are better. Whoa, that smells really good. I gotta wash that down. Yeah. <laughs> good thing we have these. Oh, man. Um. It does not taste like funnel cake to me. It's almost, I can almost, it, it's like a lot of sugar. Um, yeah, that's almost pure sugar. Gosh. Well, it's gone in sugar. I can't really describe the flavor, though. It's, it's like fried sugar. I mean, that's yeah. funnel cake, though. <laughs> I, I don't know. It's perfectly sweet. Perfectly sweet. Also gluten-free and kosher. This is one that I'm very curious to try. It is ketchup flavored potato chips. Now, I, 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 I've heard that these are popular in Canada. And everyone has seen who taste tested these on YouTube actually kind of liked them. <laughs> so, there you go. Wow, look at the color on that. Very crimson. That looks like it should be spicy. Yeah, it looks dangerous. That has a very vinegary smell. Yes. Which makes sense. All right, I'm gonna try it. There you go. Wow. It hits you immediately. Mm. That's not what I was expecting. But I do like it. I like it. It's like salt and vinegar, but not so intense. Yeah. And, um,. The ketchup is kind of there, but it's a subtle, like you almost have to breathe, <laughs> and then it's there. Hmm. Wow. You almost have to look for that ketchup flavor, but once you find it, you see. That was a pleasant surprise. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, this one is called Chickies and Pete's Famous Crab Fries. <laughs> I don't know who these people are. 
your seasoned seasoned potato chips with white, creamy cheese sauce flavoring. That's a lot of words. <laughs> you want to smell before or after you taste? Well, you smell it, man. I have to do it. Oh, so. Okay. Well, just, I mean, I don't want to taste it, but I smell it. Crap fries. I do not want to smell it. <laughs> it's not so good. Oh, the aftertaste is worse. Mm. <laughs> so <much> bitter. <laughs> Here's one that I think it will be very good. This is uh, baby back ribs flavored and very appropriate for North Carolina. Mm. Woo! <laughs> I think I just got a bunch of barbecue sauce dust up my nose. <laughs> it wasn't a bad experience, to be honest. So that, that just smells like pure yeah. barbecue. It smells very like hickory smoked. <laughs> you want a huff? <laughs> oh, yes. Oh. Yeah, that, no, that was not, I didn't see that coming. It goes right to the back of your throat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It smells like burnt wood. Mm. It smells like burnt wood or tastes like burnt wood? Both. <laughs> mm. Yeah, that's that's very, very like straight up barbecue sauce. Yeah. They did a really good job reproducing that flavor. Mm. I like this one a lot. I couldn't eat a whole bag, but... Like, You're not just a snack person, though, really. Yeah. Just having a couple of them, that's good stuff. This is Old Bay Seasoning Potato Chips. <laughs> I like Old Bay Seasoning on crabs and scallops and things like that, but I don't, like, you know, pour the stuff down my throat. But, I don't know, maybe it'll work. I'll have to try it. Oh yeah, that's Old Bay. <laughs> <laughs> that's the stuff. That's the best, right? So I guess these are just potato chips with Old Bay seasoning on them. Uh-huh. Musky. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. That is disgusting. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was a mistake. That's the worst one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was worse than pound cake. But, it, I mean, it's exactly what it says. It's Old Bay <laughs> on a chip. <laughs> it's just not pleasant. <laughs> oh. Alright, now, one thing you can get at the Harris factory that you can't get at the stores are the failed products. That is, something went wrong during the manufacturing process. Maybe a different spice went in. Maybe too much spice went in. Maybe too little. They call it oops. And you get them for 50% off. <laughs> so, here is an oops. Fire roasted sweet corn flavored popcorn. We don't know what the mistake was. We've never tasted what the real one will taste like. Well, you just have to figure it out. <laughs> so this is supposed to be sweet corn flavored. That's such a random... So sweet corn flavored corn? Yeah. It's it's like flavored as itself, but yeah. in a different form. <laughs> well, it's, it's popcorn, so we'll get like a couple of them, I guess. Mm. Oops. We'll get that later. Oops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. I actually do kind of... Hmm. Is that sweet corn flavor? It is a bit sweet, yeah. Yeah, like, you know, when you chomp down on the ear mm. of sweet corn. That actually works. <laughs> <laughs> did not ex- How did they do this? They must have a bunch of chemists working for them to do this, you know? Flavor chemists? That's pretty interesting. Just to the... Yeah. Wow. Yeah, the flavor fascinated me more than it, like, satisfied me. <laughs> Which one's this? Oh, we have another oops. So this is supposed to be honey barbecue flavor. 
got a big old red onion in the background. Oh, and here's a picture of the man himself looking very pleased with this potato chip. <laughs> yeah, interesting. They have a, a couple of Sharpie marks on the back, like, pull this from the line, sell it to some suckers. <laughs> Happy to oblige. Can't really place the smell. Not much of a smell, Probably not enough seasoning. Honey barbecue, maybe. Yeah, I, I can I can sense the honey. Mm. But not much. No, it's not a strong flavor at all. Yeah. Maybe they forgot the barbecue. So maybe. <laughs> maybe this is like too much honey, not enough barbecue. Mm. I like it. Well, hopefully this one's good because there's a lot of it. <laughs> this is a very simple cheese-flavored popcorn. Oops. Freshness not guaranteed. <laughs> <laughs> well, they do have a very intense orange to them. Oh, how about that? Perfectly apportioned. Yeah. Thank you. I would be okay with if it's like too much cheese. Cheese is always good. Well, we'll find out. See, I don't. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Tastes like normal cheese popcorn to me. Yeah. I like them. Hmm. All right. So anytime you get a chance to stop by a food factory, stop in. You never know what you're going to find. I like this. All those bags were like 25 bucks total. Good price. And don't forget, we got a, ch a chip thingy. Hmm. And we even got a commemorative chip clip. <laughs> this has been JJ Chips Truck Stop Dying! <laughs> <laughs>